Pepsi, live for now. Carmelo Anthony called last night's 31-point loss to the Spurs, quote, embarrassing, a term that best describes J.R. Smith's season debut. Smith was rusty, shooting one for nine and scoring five points all in the second half. Smith, who did not play in the fourth quarter, finished with four turnovers in 2033. He looked really out of sorts tonight. You know, he was fumbling the ball. He was falling on a lot of shots. You know, maybe an air ball in there, here or there. It's going to take him some time to get his rhythm back. He's going to have to continue working and rehabbing to get that knee right. All my turnovers is pretty much, pretty much on the ball. Uh, hit one out of bounds. I thought it went off the ref, but it didn't. Uh, just trying to fine guys and I wasn't able to get in that same rhythm that I'm normally in but uh, I mean that's just that'll come with game experience and right now playing time is exactly what JR needs he underwent knee surgery in mid-July and had an extra five games to rehab after being suspended by the league for marijuana use Mark Berman of the New York Post explains this is essentially his preseason and first time he spent most of the summer not playing basketball He's admitted his left leg still doesn't have the strength, and that's concerning. Now, if JR can return to form and eventually enter the starting lineup, the man who could be on the way out is Iman Shumpert. According to Frank Isola of the Daily News, the rest of the league seems to value Iman more than the Knicks do, said one Eastern Conference executive, and his value is high. One possible destination being floated is Denver in exchange for power forward and Newark, New Jersey native Kenneth Fareed. For Recapper, presented by Pepsi, I'm Stephanie Cohen. Get the whole story here.